Hello, Mr. Fit Geek here. Thank you for coming along to this tutorial for iMovie. And today we're going to be looking at how to create jump cuts and zoomed in sections of your movie. So let us start. All you need to do is when you're in iMovie is drop in the clip in which you're wanting to cut. And then this is quite a simple technique, but very, very effective and something I'm sure you've seen uh, on many of your favorite YouTubers. But basically, once you've dropped your, your, your video clip in here, all you need to do is, is then go to where you are needing to cut it. And if you do Command and B, what this will do then is split the clip, as you can see here. And then you are then able to go through and highlight the sections or the sections that you no longer use. So I want, oh, there's a dead bit of air here, so Command and B. So this is the part I'm going to delete. So let's go through a little bit more. I'm going to actually split it again. Uh, where are we? Let's split it here. And I'm going to split it again here. And once more, let's go through. This isn't going to make any sense, by the way, when you listen to it back, because I'm actually not listening to my uh, my voice here. So I don't, I can't actually hear the sections which are dead. But this gives you the effect of actually what jump cutting is and the effect it creates. So I've split the clip here. So I've got one section that I'm going to delete, another section I'm going to delete, and then one more section I'm going to delete. So then if we played this back, Mr. Fit Geek here. So, my review of the Apple Pencil. I've had my first impressions. I've now taken implement on my iPad Pro, and this is the review of. Okay, so you get the idea. Um, actually, one of those cuts unintentionally worked out pretty well, which is good. So, but the idea is that it creates this nice clipped quick succession and it helps speed up and it's really great when you have your uhs and your ums and your uh dead space in your video you can listen back to Bobby. where you wanted to Apple pencil stay tuned yeah you can delete all those now actually say there was a section that you wanted to create a bit more of a dramatic effect so i'm going to highlight this middle section here and now what i want to do with this is actually zoom in to uh, my hand and i want to go a little bit closer to to my face and my hand here so what you need to do is you go to your the section at the top here go to your crop area and then don't select fit, select where it says crop to fill. Crop to fill will then bring up a small crosshair in the middle here and then your crop arrows. So drag your crop arrows in and the further you drag them in, the more it will zoom in technically and, um, and crop off the sides. And then what you need to do is you drag it and then you need to position it slightly until you find this yellow crosshair. Once you've done so, click on the blue accept arrow there and then what this will do is create this nice quick zoom in feature as part of the video hello welcome mr fit geek here so my review of the apple pencil i've had my first impressions i've now taken implement on my ipad pro and and then goes back out again so a really nice technique and a really fun way in which to create a little bit more of an engagement in your videos and um, yeah keep keep your audience's attention so that is how to do jump cuts and how to do zoom cuts within iMovie hopefully you found this video useful I hope you were able to apply it to some of your videos as always if you did find this useful please do drop it a thumbs up it's much appreciated and do keep subscribed to this channel this is a new channel so any subscriptions or any likes are greatly appreciated so Mr Fit Geek here and don't forget you know the drill keep fit look after yourselves and stay geeky any questions at all pop them in the comment box and i'll be sure to come back to you over and out for now cheers